After work, people may be too exhausted to cook, and doctors say that can lead to unhealthy eating and even sleeping habits. WIFR reporter Bria Walters talks to lifestyle experts about how to break these routines. Time and energy is precious when you're working. People overwhelmed by busy schedules may let it affect their diet. A study done by Talker Research uses answers from 2,000 Americans. 77% admit that sometimes after work they're too tired to cook. You're starving and you're looking for something to fill your stomach because you're tired, you want to go to bed. Um, so we often don't make the best choices at that point. Uh, it's, it's easy because and it's kind of how we're wired. Convenience is a part of the problem, says Talker. When people are too tired to cook, they turn to convenience meals like sandwiches, fast food, and microwavable dinners. But UW Health Lifestyle Medicine Manager Brianne Thornton says cooking balanced meals after work may be just as easy. Have a meal plan. That way, hopefully, you're only going to the store once a week. Um, cooking at night takes a lot of energy and time, and going to the grocery store beforehand just takes up more of that energy that we that we want to use for cooking. OSF nutritionist Jason Crumb says eating through the day and staying hydrated can help you feel less tired after work. You should eat your last snack or meal at least two hours before bed in order to get good sleep and be prepared for the next day. Um, if you're getting home at 7, 8 o'clock at night and you usually go to bed at 10, um, you're, you're kind of asking for a disrupted sleep cycle, especially if you haven't had any meal prepared. In Rockford, Bria Walters, WIFR News. Talker also says 74% of those surveyed said they'd be interested in eating a healthier diet if it was easier to find ingredients, cheaper, and took less time to prepare.